yeah, it's, it feels like so much has gone down since since then. A lot of has, so it's uh, kind of forgot about it almost. What kind of attitude are you bringing into your first training? Program? Are you are you do you have to even like look at it and be like, you know what, I'm just gonna try and make the team, you know? Or yeah, definitely. You want to be confident that you could that you can try to make the team, but uh, you never know what's going to happen. So you just go out there and play the way you've played your whole life and just show your skills off and then see where things go from there. How, how has the summer treated you? I know it's been pretty busy. You've been playing a lot. How, how, what has the summer been like since you've been drafted? Uh, I really haven't been home at all. I've just been going to camp to camp, just playing hockey all summer, and then I uh, just came right to here. Well, what's the key to keeping fresh and, and not getting tired going into you know your first professional camp like this? Uh, just finding little breaks when you can. Just find the time when you got to take. You got to uh, schedule your workouts. Uh, pretty, it's pretty tough. Like you got to find time to have a little bit of rest, even though, it's, like I said, it's really packed. But there's time to find rest in there, and it gets ready for this. Are you the kind of guy that when you close your eyes, you fall right asleep, like that kind of rest? Yeah, that's basically it. Just a lot. Just not. And some days, like not skating, not doing anything, just having a day to yourself. That helps a lot. So I know you have quite the athletic background in, in your family. Does that help you as well with just maybe a mindset of how to handle all of this? Yeah, definitely. I've uh, been doing this in other bunch of other sports. I've always had busy summers, and now it's just busy just mostly hockey so that's definitely helped me a lot so what sort of hopes do you have for this tournament for this opportunity here to be with these guys and going into training camp what, what do you hope to get out of this tournament? uh we definitely want to win a bunch of games try to win this tournament that's the goal and uh, personally i want to show off my skills and uh, show what i can do out there uh, yeah so what do you think people will see from you because obviously blue jackets fans are still kind of getting to know you a little yeah. bit what are they going to see from you this weekend and then going into camp uh they'll definitely see some speed that's my biggest asset of my game they'll see me skating out there pretty fast and I'll try to do that my best and I'll show off my uh, offense abilities. This might be a silly question. When did you realize you were fast? Uh, since a very young age. I just remember you'd race outside, just running off the ice or on the ice. I always, I'd always win a bunch of races, and that's when I realized I was pretty fast. Was it ever a challenge to translate that to ice? No, not really. It was just natural. It just came natural. I was always really fast on the ice. What's it like having the chance to play with Billy? Uh, it's pretty cool uh, playing with him my two years in London, and uh, he's a great guy. We hang out a lot, so having him here, it's really comforting, and it's nice to be out there with him. Uh, are you excited that he has an opportunity to, to hopefully find somewhere to be? Yeah, definitely. Him being invited as a free agent, that's huge for Billy, and uh, to him to come here and show what he's able to do, it's, uh, it's pretty big.